Next up, we're stopping at our good friend Mike's coffee roastery. Attraction Coffee. Here. here. You've probably seen I had my own coffee through them. And here we are. Let's walk in. Jason's already here. Let's check it out. Ooh, got the forges out here. This is where the magic happens, huh? Where's the man himself? There he is. Look at this place. You pumping? Welcome, welcome. What's up? Thank you. Yeah. This place looks sick. Thank I'm, you. I'm so pumped to be here. I'll pause the music so you don't get copyrighted. So Ooh, I, all party. kinds of cool stuff. Yeah, yeah. Look at this. Yeah. It's Heck where yeah. The party goes down. So Mike, like you're gonna is... show us how to roast coffee? Oh yeah. So when we get coffee, it looks like this. So this is considered like green coffee. So this is basically like in its raw form. Then we dump it in here. Um, we preheat this kind of like an oven. So most of our coffees are like preheated to like 440 degrees. We drop it like this. And then there's a drum in here that's spinning. And underneath there's just gas burners. Yeah. And we can control the gas here. And then we can also control the airflow. So how much air is running across the coffee. Um, and then on that screen there, we have basically like a, a graph that's charting how much airflow is going on, how much gas is going, like, and it's basically like a bell curve. So you're just like watching that's that dope. and trying to make it like as perfect as possible. So it's roasting coffee amazing. here is tough because the weather changes so quick. Oh, yeah. You know, so you know, yesterday it was 80 degrees and today it's 60 degrees. So the ambient temperature of the room changes Got a lot. Tweak of everything too. always. Wow. Yeah. So like think about like. I mean, some days the beans in here are like 50 degrees, and other days they're 80 degrees. So like, you're changing that base level of where it like bottoms out. So it's kind of crazy. So what are we making here? Pull on a nice shot of a uh, National Columbia espresso. Be nice on the forge? On the forge, baby. So the cool thing about these two is you can pressure profile. So like we're gonna go up to two bars of pressure, which is 30 PSI. And we're gonna wait till we get a couple drops in the cup. So there comes a couple there. So if you peek underneath, it's gonna get super pretty. And we're gonna go up to nine bar, which is 130 PSI. That is very pretty. <laughs> it's like zebra stripey. Yeah. Super That's satisfying. crazy. Oh, y'all don't mess around with this. No. Look at that pressure. It's all in the arms. Who's up first? Boji? <laughs> Let's see it. Cheers. Mm. Pinky's out, baby. <laughs> Pinky's out. Find out. Pinky's out. Oh, baby. One sip? <laughs> oh, baby. We're passing this around, right? Oh, dude. I guess. I yeah. can make as many as you guys Thank want. You. <laughs> How is it? Oh, my God. Right it's in the brain. Really good. Dude, James. So, what is this stuff? It's called Kiskara. So, coffee beans actually grow inside of cherries. Not a lot of people know that. So, these are the cherries that are dried out. It smells so good. And the best part is, so is it tastes way different than it actually smells. It's like a uh, cherry, like cranberry, very sweet and tart. It's cool. You gonna bless us with some? About to bless you guys. Uh, sturdy boys, they call it. American manufacturing. So it's a weapon. So basically, just making this like tea. Yeah. Um. So we always say this is like the crossroads between coffee and tea. So it has a little bit of caffeine, but it's super rich in antioxidants, and it's like very sweet. I like to make simple syrup out of it, make margaritas, that's pretty good. You like to make margaritas out of everything. That's true. This is dope, this is like a nice process. Very simple, and like watch the color, it changes like to such a beautiful red too. And once these heat up, you can like pull them out and you'll see like, it'll puff back up to like the bean shape, yeah. Some of them still have the bean in there, which is kind of interesting too, to like be able to see that. Let, let's see what you think, first sip. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh, that's good. Isn't that crazy? That's really good. I'll like make big so batches different. of it and then yeah. like put it in the fridge so I can like drink like iced tea. All it's the crazy. Time. What is that? Back up some for the road. This is the Kiskara. Kiskara. Kiskara? The coffee tea? So it's the cherries, yeah. right? Cherry coffee tea. Something like that. It's really good. 
Got the box of traction goodies. Mike here Ooh. did the podcast, Scared to Normal. Make sure to give it a listen. We're excited about this one. I don't yeah. know. It'll probably come out middle of June or something like that. So yeah, yeah. Well, thanks for it. thanks for having us at the grocery. Yeah, thanks for coming by, man. This was finally a truly finally made it here. Yeah, yeah. dream come Sick. true. Best coffee, best coffee. Make sure to check them out. Thank you.